Hey guys, my name is Natalie and today I'm going to be reviewing The Czar of Love and Techno by Anthony Moore. Uh, this book was sent to me by the publisher. Um, I think I wanted on a giveaway or something. I don't know. It's coming out um, October the 6th and it was a very good story. Now this novel is a collection of short stories, so I, this book is a collection of short stories. And they're all interconnected in different ways and really unsuspecting ways, but there are certain characters that'll pop up in, you know, a different story um, and be introduced later on. And then you'll realize, oh, that was so-and-so from, you know. I really liked this book. I'd probably give it a four out of five stars or maybe five out of five. I don't know. It's a little bit in between there. I enjoyed it. It's not my typical genre. Um, these, these stories take place in Russia starting with uh, the narrator who is a censor. He is tasked with correcting artwork per Stalin's orders and it just, it was my favorite. The first story was my absolute favorite and I loved how eventually, you know, you saw just different pieces of this man's history and learning about his family and it was just a again very thought-provoking very interesting read one you definitely needed to pay attention to to keep up with but very enjoyable way out of my wheelhouse but i absolutely loved being pushed out of my comfort zone and into this book it's very very good i would definitely recommend it to anyone uh it was just really a good thought-provoking read and i think it's just beautiful too like absolutely stunning cover Definitely a great book to pick up. So yeah, it comes out again on the 6th of October, which is right around the corner. I don't know how we're already almost in October. Crazy. Again, Star Love and Techno by Anthony Marr. I hope you enjoy it. If you read it, um, leave me, let me know. If you're into Russian literature, Russian history, it's very good. Um, again, I really liked it. That's about it for today. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, again, leave them below. I'd love to hear it. I hope you have a wonderful day.